everyone, it's Sam Luisa from Sweet Kisses Band and I'm here for another K-pop inspired makeup. This time it's a generic K-pop smoky eye makeup. So initially I wanted to do Jessica's Mr. Mr. Makeup but then I realized that other K-pop artists or other K-pop girl groups also wear this smoky eye makeup like this most of the time so I just decided to call it the K-pop smoky eye makeup tutorial. So if you guys are interested to see how I did this look then do keep on watching. So first, I moisturize my face using my Nature Public Aloe Vera Soothing Gel. And then I prime my eyelids using my ELF Eyelid Primer it's from their studio line. And this is just gonna help make the colors of our eyeshadows pop out and just to help keep it in place and not crease. Then taking my Nichido Mineral Coal Pencil in Onyx. I'm basically just going to use this to align my upper waterline, no, my upper lash line, like so. And for this, I chose a pencil liner that can easily be smudged, but you can choose whatever eyeliner that you want. And right now, I'm just lining my lower waterline, but I'm just keeping it onto the outer half of my lower waterline. Keeping the inner corners clean, and then I'm just kind of dragging it down precisely onto the lower lids. Like that and then with the matte black shadow this one is from my Sephora sunset palette I'm basically just setting that eyeliner keep it in place and then I'm just carefully dragging the lower line up like so Basically, what I want to do is I want to create an outer V. And it's real hard to explain, but basically, I just extended the lower line like that. And then for the other half of my outer V, I just dragged it into where I felt my crease is at. So it ends right about there. And I'm just filling it in like so. And then afterwards, with the same matte black shadow. You just want to set everything. Now I'm taking my Face Shop Eyebrow Powder Duo, but you can use a matte brown shadow if you want. So basically, you just want to blend the edges like that because right now it looks very harsh, but yeah, once blended, it's gonna look a lot better. Okay, blend everything like so. It looks a little bit messy but it's gonna look a lot better once we finish everything up. And then with my waterproof gel liner, or you can use the same eyeliner that you used earlier, just like to use this waterproof one when tight lining. So yeah, basically you just want a tight line and then you want to redefine the line onto your lower waterline as well. Now I'm just taking this matte light pink shadow. You can also use a matte off-white shadow I guess. But basically you want it to be matte and you want the color to be light. And you basically apply it onto the inner portion of your lid, going a bit into the v-shape that we use at the side like so and you basically just want to blend that all together and then with the same shadow just highlight your brow bone like so and then using this infallible l'oreal eyeshadow in blinged in brilliant or any peachy goldish kind of shade just apply it onto the inner corner to brighten up the look and I think this is very essential to make the look brighter and, you know, look more pop-ish, I guess. And then with the same waterproof gel liner, I'm just redefining my upper lash line. And then with the lash curler of your choice and mascara of your choice, I'm using Fine Scenario Lash Curler and the Clinique Double Volume Mascara, I guess. Not sure of the name, but yeah. 
You want to curl your lashes, uh, lashes and apply some mascara. Now, when applying the mascara for your lower lashes, just keep it onto the outer half, like so. So now with my K palette liquid liner, or any liquid liner of your choice, this is actually optional, but if you want the look to look sharper, then you need to redefine the upper lash line like so. And maybe do a little bit of a flick, like that. So if you're satisfied with the way it looks, you can stop right here. But personally, I feel that it looks a little bit more glamorous with fake lashes. So yeah, you can also apply fake lashes of your choice. Yes. So this is how it's going to look like. I know I wasn't able to show you guys how I applied the fake lashes. That's because I'm not an expert at that. So I didn't even want to try filming it for you guys. So yeah. Basically, this is how the makeup looks like, so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I hope that you have fun watching it, and yeah. Thank you so much for watching, and if you guys have any requests, comments, suggestions, just leave them down below in the comment section, and yeah. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching, and see you guys in my next video. Bye!